subject of the course is related to the microscopic structure of condensed matter, with particular emphasis to metals. The course also introduces the fundamental spectroscopic tools for the experimental investigation of condensed matter, such as photoemission spectroscopy. The course is attended at the third year of the Bachelor degree in Engineering Physics at Politecnico di Milano. The exam consists of two steps. The first one is an open book and relies on solving complex written problems. After that, students have to sustain an oral examination. Since the exam is based on high-level and non-standard exercises, during the past years, most of the students have underlined the need to practice about complex exercises with the help of the professors. To this purpose, the active learning has been introduced to increase the students' attitude to face complex problems and formulate physical arguments while debating them with other students, maybe in small groups. The idea was to uh, provide also for a deeper understanding of the topics proposed during the lectures. The active learning has been developed as follows. An exercise has been proposed to the students after the end of each of the four modules the course is made of. They had one week to solve at home and submit it. Moreover, students have been communicated that the results of these assignments will contribute to the final evaluation. After this, the exercise solution has been discussed within the classroom together with us and the students. Some points of the exercise have been debated by means of teacher-paced Socrative quizzes, whereas the most difficult ones have been developed by the professors while being discussed with students. Since the course is attended by many students, the use of Socrative quizzes helped us to understand if some of them had particular problems about specific point of the exercise, whereas most of the efforts have been dedicated to the discussion of the most complex parts. In this case, we have encouraged the direct participation of the students by sharing with them some hints to correctly solve specific points and listening to their doubts and suggestions. We decided to focus on soft skills IELTS on teamwork and scientific communication. Our plan was to divide the whole class in groups of three, four students who could discuss the answer and the tricks related to the solution of the exercise. Then, we also planned to select a group to show the solution of one point of the exercise directly in front of the classroom in order to enforce the discussion and the scientific communication. Unfortunately, however, the COVID emergency has changed the planned activities and the whole course has been performed online. It was therefore not possible to perform teamwork activities, whereas the discussion and scientific communication with the professor concerning questions and doubts within the classroom have been maintained. The participation of the students has been satisfactory since all of them have solved at home the exercise as requested. Moreover, a large number of questions and doubts have been exposed during the activities, both from a scientific and methodological point of view. We managed to organize Q&A sessions after each point of the proposed exercise and favor the discussion with the students. The use of Socrative quizzes allowed us to rapidly solving the easy points of the exercise without neglecting the students' doubts. Moreover, the large number of students was not a limiting factor, even if the large number of questions did not allow us to always conclude the lessons in time. The active learning has been appreciated by the students. Testing their understanding of the subject by means of the exercise development, they were able to better formulate their answers and doubts with respect to what generally happens during lectures. The use of quizzes is important to understand common mistakes among students and save time for more difficult points to be discussed. Moreover, encouraging team working and discussion where possible is important. <laughs>